You might see potatoes as little more than future french fries, but plant genetics researchers see this bag of potato pieces as doses of hepatitis B vaccine. They genetically modified them to see if plants could be turned into producers of medicine. All we're trying to do is modernize this with a new technology, inserting genes into plants, to cause the plants to produce a novel new pharmaceutical, and in our particular case, this is uh, vaccines. Writing in Proceedings of the National Academy of Sciences, Hugh Mason and Charles Arntzen explained 60% of the volunteers who ate the potatoes showed signs of increased immunity. While the first tests were on people who had been previously vaccinated, Mason says the next step is to see how it works for those who have never been vaccinated. Well, we want to find out if we can uh, uh, provoke antibody responses in individuals that have not previously seen this particular protein. But don't expect to eat future vaccines. They eventually plan to use plants that won't get into the food supply to manufacture medicines. The public deserves to be assured that anything we're doing in modification of plants is not going to result in material that will enter the food chain. Their goal is to find a simpler way to produce, store, manufacture and deliver vaccines as capsules. And that's why we've been working on new technology to produce the antigens, that's the vaccine in a plant tissue, freeze dry it, make it in a form that you can simply store it on the shelf and use semi-trained healthcare professionals around the world. A goal that rests inside the genes of this super spud. I'm Karen Lurie.